Hello guys, welcome to another brand new video where we are here with another brand new fix. Do you have a 128 GB card but it's showing 32 GB or less? Then check out this video and we will show you the possible fixes. But before moving on to the fixes, make sure that your SD card is actually 128 GB. If you have purchased it in lower price, then it might not actually be 128 GB. Maybe it's just showing 128 GB on the card front, but maybe it's just a smaller card. So try placing your card on multiple computers to check it out. And then if you think it's actually 128 GB, then move on to start and right click on it. Then go to disk management. After that, you'll have to select your my one is not an SD card, it's just a flash drive, but it will do because both of them are removable drives. Well, my flash drive is formatted for Windows, so it has two partitions. Well, I'm going to format the main partition, right click on it, select format, and then file system NTFS, and then perform a quick format. Okay. As you can see guys, it has been formatted and after getting formatted, it will show the actual data of your card and if it's still not showing, make sure that it's formatted in one partition. As you can see, it has 29.02 GB here and one megabyte is only here. And maybe your disk, maybe your card is formatted 32 GB here and the rest is not even partitioned. So in that case, you'll have to delete volume. Make sure to delete entire volume and then and then it will be unallocated then right click on it select new simple volume select next make sure that it's having the maximum number here and then assign a drive letter and select file system ntfs because it's better these days and then select next finish and then you should be getting the actual file size of the flash drive or sd card as you can see my one has 29 gigs now so guys that's how you can format it and delete your partition and make a new partition and that's how you can get the actual size of your card and if the problem remains please let us know down below in the comment section and thank you so much for watching today's video if you found these methods helpful please do leave a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video until then take care and stay safe